Hello and welcome to this tutorial. In this video, we will explore the augmented replay to learn how to make the best of this amazing resource provided with Skill Gym. You can access the augmented replay at the bottom of the analytics page. Once you start, it will present you with the recording of your conversation where your choices are replaced by a spoken voice so that you can follow the dialogue stepping back to a third party position just like if you were listening to the conversation done by someone else. First thing you may want to do is to browse through the different steps of the conversation. Just click on the step you want to move to on the numbered bar below and play and pause at any time to review it again and again. But the augmented replay is much more than that. As you can see on the screen, there are multiple visual aids that will help you understand the quality of your performance in every single detail. This is an amazing way to improve, since you can actually delve into the deepest behaviors you took and see the reaction of your counterpart. Let's see them one by one. The first thing you notice is this colored curve at the bottom. You see that it moves up and down step after step. It represents your ongoing confidence in the conversation. As explained in another video tutorial, confidence is your ability to select meaningful sentences to say at the right moment to achieve your goals during the conversation. This line is a good trigger for your attention in this phase of review of the conversation. You can decide to put your focus at understanding why at some points you did great or why at some others your performance suffered. Adapt your analysis to the circumstances and focus on those points where you want either to define a best practice or you want to understand why you did not achieve a good result. Once you choose where to focus on, you can direct your attention to the balloons on the screen. When you hear the voiceover and the character is listening, that's where you were talking. The box on the left shows a comment on the quality of your sentence at that point in the conversation. The colored border gives you a quick view of the overall quality of your choice. And when the character answers back, the following box provides you with a hint about the character's intention behind his words. At any time, you can click this button to enter the more analytical area of the augmented replay, where you can literally analyze each step of the conversation in even higher detail. This is a key point for you to learn. Take your time to review the different body and facial expressions related to the different parts of the conversation and familiarize yourself with the way the characters express their intentions beyond their spoken words. You can see the transcript of the conversation of this step. Your sentence is measured in terms of quality of the relevant underlying behavior and you're presented with a recommendation on how to improve next time you play, with the possibility to look at the options that were available to you at that step of interaction. The answer of the character is also measured, providing you with the actual level of engagement in the discussion. This is a great time to ask yourself some questions to improve. For example, let's imagine you scored low, like orange, a powerful question you can ask yourself will be, why did I perform so low here? Or even better, how could I do better? Which other sentence would have improved my confidence here? Both of you are also measured in terms of quality trend of your behaviors and of the character's engagement. Frequently, you will notice that your improvements do not always match a direct improvement for the character and the other way around. This can be typically because of some past behaviors of yours that still resonate with the character, influencing his engagement more than your current words. You can go back to the main view by clicking this button. Back to the main screen, you notice at the bottom the position of the three goals of this conversation. Simply click on one of them to open the details window. You will have more information about which behaviors of yours influence that outcome and, where meaningful, also a list of the subjects that should have been developed more to achieve the goal. 
We recommend you leverage this amazing resource named Augmented Replay as much as you can. You don't need to go through the entire interview every time. Simply focus on those steps where you feel you did great, or instead, you did particularly badly. This is a good approach to start asking powerful questions and reflecting upon the way you actually behave, and most of all, on the way people respond to your behaviors. Feel free to watch it continuously or a step-by-step. -step. You can also do this by using this feature in the side menu. And you can also decide to hide the visual aids if you prefer to find out by yourself where you did right or wrong. This is another interesting way to enhance your critical vision and your self-awareness.